Tessa, you have chosen the ideal location to get married. A place, some call paradise. A place of warmth, beauty, and peace. And in this place, this afternoon, where heaven meets earth, so too your souls meet to become one. And I will do everything in my power as a husband and as a man to make sure that this family and our relationship is successful no matter what we do and where we end up. And I vow to love you for the rest of my life as long as I may live. When I think of you, um, I think of my partner. And people ask, who is he and why are you marrying him? It's because of that. Any of my shortcomings you fulfill. We match each other. Mm, and we yes. finish each other. We complete each other. And I love you. And I vow to always be your partner. Through thick and through thin. We'll always be together. Do you, Peter, take Tessa to be your wife? To laugh with her in joy? To grieve with her in sorrow? To grow with her in love? to be faithful to her as long as both of you shall live? Yes, I do. Do you, Peter, yeah. take Tessa to be your lawful wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, as long as you both shall live? Do you take Tessa? I do. I do take Tessa. That's just talking to you. No. I do take Tessa. Yes. Do you, Peter, solemnly declare that you will take Tessa to be your lawfully wedded wife? And do you solemnly declare that there is no legal impediment to this marriage? I do. Tessa, I will ask you the same. Do you, Tessa, take Peter to be your husband, to laugh with him in joy, to grieve with him in sorrow, to grow with him in love, to be faithful to him as long as both of you shall live? I do. Do you, Tessa, take Peter to be your lawful husband, to have and to hold, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and okay. in health, as long as you both shall live? I do. 
do you Tessa solemnly declare that you will take Peter to be your lawfully wedded husband? And do you solemnly declare that there is no legal impediment to this marriage? I do. Tessa. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. In the name of God. In the name of God. As a symbol. As a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. Devotion. Devotion. And fidelity. And frugality. To you. I don't know. To you. Dirty ball. Yeah. We got it. We got it. Fingers we got swollen. it. Fingers yeah. swollen. It's okay. okay. Peter. Yes. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. In the name of God. In the name of God. As a symbol. As a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. Devotion. Devotion. And fidelity. And fidelity. To you. That's to you. What it was. Place okay. the ring on Peter's finger. My ring, my ring I <laughs> By the virtue of the powers of the laws of St. Lucia vested in me as a civil status marriage officer, and by the very authority of love, and in the presence of your family and friends, I pronounce Peter and Tessa to be husband and wife. Peter, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> To ride here with me This is a time I now present As husband and wife Mr. and Mrs. Peter Lady and Agnes Congratulations! And will you be forever mine? And be my always? This love will hold the test of time. Will you be forever mine? And be my always? The first and last one I love. I'll be forever mine. I will follow through it all In your hand I'll never let it go The stars above Have led me to your side Dreams can come true. I'll be yours forever. Your strength through any weather. Will you be forever mine? Be my always. This love will hold the test. First and last one I love and be forever mine. The only thing that lasts, we fit so perfectly. You're all that ever matters, and only you and me. Will you be forever mine? And be my always the first and last one I love. Will you be forever mine? And be my always this love will hold the test.